So, uh, so my name is Grace. I am 23. I'm from Phoenix, Arizona. I am currently a student of physical therapy. I'm in my second year. Um, I chose to volunteer with a broader view because they gave me a chance to work for a long period of time. I looked for a lot of different programs and most programs offered the opportunity to work in your chosen area for three, maybe four hours a day. Um, what I really wanted was a chance to get involved with the work as much as possible and a broader view was the only program I found that let me work for an entire day, like basically 40 hours a week. So my volunteer work involves assisting the physical therapists. Like I said, I'm a student in physical therapy. So uh, I came here, um, I come in every day and I just try to help out with the kids, help engage them in their therapy, um, help just uh, provide exercises and <clears throat> help with anything else that the clinic might need. So I did some organizational work and it was good bonding time with the other clinicians there to help them with whatever they needed and basically kind of be another clinician alongside them. So. Um, I lived with a local family here and uh, it was a lot of fun. It was really good. Um, I had kind of the perfect situation. I like to have my alone time so the setup was nice where I could come and associate with the family and like build bonds and have a good time with them but I could also withdraw and just kind of decompress after a long day of working and a long day of processing the new language that I was trying to learn and trying to use. Um, and it was really good. They were an awesome resource for how to live here and um, just how to get around and what to do and what to see if you want to go sightseeing. I would definitely recommend a broad review to others who are interested in volunteering. Um, I think my biggest piece of advice would be ask a lot of questions before you come. Um, and just to get a sense of your program, like what exactly is it? What exact work are you going to do? Um, just so that you have in your mind a really set idea of what you're going to be doing when you get here as much as you can. You definitely have to come in open-minded and flexible, um, but it's always good to know what exactly you're getting yourself into. Um, so that's my first piece of advice. And my second piece of advice would be use the resources that you have here. Um, if you're staying with a local family, ask them a ton of questions. Just ask them. Uh, if it's a new language, ask them how to say things if you're not good at that language. Like, what's this called and how do you say this? And they'll be really happy to teach you. Um, and ask them, like, how to get from here to there. If you're working in a place that's maybe not as safe, ask, like, how do I stay safe? What are some tips? Um, yeah, just kind of use the resources that you have and definitely be flexible.